Monday. It's a new week. Today's a doozy. Today is the last time Mason will put on his high school baseball uniform. So today's senior night. <laughs> How many times am I gonna cry? Are you ready? How do you parents do this? <laughs> Ooh. Seems like yesterday that he was a freshman putting on this uniform. But here we are. It's coming to an end. So tonight is senior night. Um, I'm not ready. It should be a good day. In fact, Mason, I think, has his senior assembly today. Senior night tonight. This week, he also has senior ditch day. But here we are. He's graduating. All right. Let me get my day started. <laughs> I think I need some coffee. It's, I've been crying, like, nonstop. I just can't stop crying. All right. <laughs> Let me get my day started. It's gonna be a good week. Don't mind all this. I am starting to get ready for senior night. Um, but Mason just came in from school wearing a crown, so I have to show him off. All right, explain yourself. Uh, I won an award. Most likely to become famous. So he had his senior assembly, and I guess everybody votes, and they voted Mason to be most likely to become famous. I won. Okay, you have to wear this during your baseball game tonight. No, I don't. What do you that think, guys? <laughs> well, congratulations, Mason. Oh, Ace, Thank you, you. want to be famous too? It's probably because of them. Well, how was the assembly? Good? Yeah, it was just last assembly. Yeah. Oh, it's so sad. It was seniors only, right? Yeah. Yeah. Fun, fun. So, you ready for tonight? Yeah. Yeah? All right. This is it. This is Let's it. Go, baby. So exciting. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Ace? I just want to sleep. He's like, That's it's nap o'clock. That's what I think. All right. Well, welcome home. He's got a few hours, and then he's off to his final high school baseball game. I know. I had to do it in front of his baby pictures. My baby. All of his pictures. Um, for the last time, Mason, in this uniform, good luck, have fun, do your best. Thank you. <laughs> Go have fun. Enjoy it. Our next great senior to honor tonight is Mason Bevenor, escorted by his parents Jack and Chrissy, grandparents Mike and Bella, and grandparents Bud and Carol. Good job, Bevo. Good job, boys. Good job, Mason.
Gomez. <laughs> That's the Willow Canyon Wildcats signing off for the 2024 season. Once again, parents and fans, thank you so much for your support and for coming to see you. You good, Jack? I guess. The walkout was hard. But we didn't cry the whole time until we were walking out because that's the last time that we'll walk out of those gates. For the last four years, we've been doing that. Mason's obviously out eating dinner with some of his teammates. Grandma and Grandpa Bevo are actually staying the night tonight, but they left a little early um, while we were taking all the photos and stuff after the game to go get themselves some dinner. So they're on their way back. Um, oh, did you guys see? I love my, look how cute that is. I think that's gonna be a wrap for tonight. Mason has gifts to open. Look at all these gifts. And then he gave me flowers. And this was from like the boosters. So fun. We did it. We did it. Next up, graduation chat. <laughs> Wow. This but, might be tougher for me than graduation. I'm not gonna no, I, and I, I understand why. <laughs> we also have the banquet, the baseball banquet, so that's coming up too. So, But we typically don't vlog that. We just 
try to enjoy it. So anyways, that's a wrap. Senior night is over. Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. I'm exhausted. Grandma and Grandpa Bevo just headed off. They're headed home. Jack's at work, Mason's off to school, but you guys, we were up so late. I don't think we ever said, so they ended up pushing our game time back last night, just I think like 30 minutes. So with that, and then it being senior night, by the time the game ended and we went out on the field and took all the photos and the coach had the last speak with like players, it got late. And then, like we said, Grandma and Grandpa Beaver went out to dinner and then Jack's like, I'm so hungry. So I ran to Wendy's and grabbed a burger for him, some chili for myself, and we were eating dinner at like 10, 10.30 last night. And then Mason finally got home, because he went out to dinner. When he got home, we sat down and talked to him probably for a good, I don't know, 45 minutes to an hour before we even headed up to go to bed, just to see how he was feeling and all the things. and. It was a long night, so here I am. I'm exhausted. But it's Tuesday, we gotta get our day started. I need a nap, and I definitely need coffee. Happy Wednesday, everyone. Which means we are halfway to the weekend. I'm excited for this weekend. It's been a long week, even though it's just Wednesday. It's been a very emotional week. I think yesterday was definitely a recovery day. I slept so much better last night, much needed rest. I was so exhausted all day yesterday. Um, in fact, nothing, <laughs> Every this is where everything landed Monday night. The house is kind of a mess. This I might keep up for just a little bit. I love it. So yeah, I'm trying to tend to the house. I did a couple loads of laundry. Um, tried to put some of this stuff away. I'm trying to recover and trying not to be sad anymore, but everything I do, like I was working on a thumbnail yesterday and like I could feel myself getting emotional again. And then you get on Facebook and all the moms, the, the other baseball moms are posting everything. Like this one mom got the best picture of the boys. So we left a little early. And I told you, Jack and I got emotional leaving out the, the gates where the baseball field is located at Mason School. Um, but a mom stayed later than us and she got the best picture of the boys, including Mason, walking out with their baseball bags. I'm like, no, 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 I can't do this today. Today, I cannot cry, <laughs> but it was a great picture and I'm glad she captured that. But it is Wednesday. Like I said, I gotta get some of this picked up, get back to a little bit of normal life, and I'm trying to decide if I have enough stuff to make for dinner tonight or if I need a grocery store because I really don't wanna go to the grocery store, but I might have to, so we'll see. I'm gonna go through the, the fridge and the, the pantry and see if I can do something for dinner tonight. Mason, after school yesterday, he took the, speaking of exhaustion, he took like an hour and a half, like holy moly, good, good nap, like crashed out on the couch. His phone was still going off and I had to turn his phone off and he just crashed out, bless his heart. I know his emotions have been crazy too. And then he ended up hanging out with his friends and ended the night with pickleball till about 10 o'clock last night, came home went to bed back to school but today is his last full day of school this week because tomorrow is senior ditch day and then they have friday off so they have like a four-day weekend but i'll talk about tomorrow tomorrow it's a little funny so we'll leave that for tomorrow but right now i'm gonna put this stuff away and figure out if i have something to make for dinner tonight the good news guys i figured out dinner i always have something to make in this house i have a little bit of onion left some leftover peppers, some brats that'll go on the grill. I'm gonna saute these, put them on my brat with some mustard. And then I do believe I have a package of probably mac and cheese I can do for the boys. I have vegetables. I can also make a salad. I have a can of beans. So I think, and I even have hot dog buns. Not that I'll use one, but the boys like to have their brats on hot dog buns. I did it. <laughs> and I didn't have to go to the store, but I think I'm probably gonna have to go tomorrow, but that's okay, I'll go tomorrow. Oh, and I started cleaning everything up, so this is all of Mason's snacks are now in here, besides I kept this one. Productive day, but also kind of sat on the couch, and <laughs> still trying to recover. Um, more pictures are coming in, I just went through them. My phone, I'm like at max storage for my, pho my photos, so I need to go through all my photos. Okay. But let me get to dinner, because Mason's saying he's hungry. End of the year grind right there. <laughs> he's doing homework outside. There's Ace, and Jack's grilling over here. <laughs> and it's, uh, 
Actually, it's not too bad. It's 87 degrees out. Good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday. Happy Senior Ditch Day, Mason. Yeah. He's downstairs. It's pretty early. Where are you headed? To school. <laughs> In a polo. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to explain? What do you got going on? My presentation. He has a presentation. He's been working on a huge capstone project in his English class and he is signed up to do his presentation on it today, which so happens to be Senior Ditch Day. So he's got to go to school. Now I say that, but he should already be in school. So he did get to sleep in a good hour longer than if he had all of his classes today. And he's only, only going to go to second period and then he's off for the rest of the day. So. He's actually the smart kid, you guys, because nobody's gonna be in his class, so when he does this presentation, it's gonna be him, one of his friends that also signed up, who's another baseball player, right? Carter has this presentation scheduled for today. Yeah. So it's probably just gonna be them, and do you think anybody else will be in class today? Maybe. Maybe. I, I, I think some people don't participate in Senior Ditch Day. I know I did, Jack did. The kids got straight A's, you guys. Take the day off, enjoy your senior year. He's headed off to that and then, um, like I said, he's only going to second period and then he has the rest of the day. But he was thinking, it's still early, it's only eight o'clock right now. All of his friends are probably sleeping in. So before they go enjoy their senior ditch day, he's like, I'm gonna get my presentation done and over with. And by the time they all wake up, I'll be home from school and my presentation will be done. All right, we'll go kill it. Good luck. Hey. Have fun. My job interview. Your job interview? I hope we get hired. Okay. All right, have fun. Be safe. Are you coming home after it or are you going straight out? Okay. Probably coming home to change, right? Yeah. All right, we'll see you in a little bit then. Hello, Jack B. Hello, Chrissy B. Are you recovered from senior night? I don't know if you've been in the vlog since then. <laughs> I've been in a state of depression for there a few days. There he is. Yeah, but the, the TV is in overdrive right now because, you guys, the Sixers are in a must win game. They need to win tonight. And then it's also the NFL draft. So I think we have about eight minutes until round one pick, right? Seven minutes. The Bears are on the clock. Seven minutes. The Bears are on the clock. Mason, you guys, did good on his um, presentation in English class today. I meant to vlog him, like I was coming in from the grocery store and he was leaving. So he, after his presentation came home, ate a breakfast sandwich and then pretty much went out. They went golfing and I think right now, you guys, they're at a park with a tarp doing like a slip and slide, I think. I don't know, that's what he said he was gonna Wait, do. What? So yeah, a big tarp. My invite. I want to do some slide. I wish I wish we would have video of that. That'd be awesome. So yeah, that's what he's doing. And then he told me tomorrow morning he's getting up because they thought about going to the lake today, but with his presentation and everything, um, I think they're gonna go to the lake tomorrow to go fishing. So I think he's gonna be getting up early. So hopefully he doesn't stay out too late because he stayed out very late last night. And normally I wouldn't let him because it's a school night and he knows better. But because it was senior ditch day today. Wait, you got a ditch? Yeah, I know. I've gotten all the phone calls from the school, all the text messages. Yes, I know my kid did not go to school today. Besides, he did go to one class. So, all right. I'm going to probably make some dinner tonight and finish watching this draft. It's always exciting. And watch the 76ers. Who's going to go round one? Round one? It's, it's the whole round tonight. I mean, pick first one? pick. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sure it's going to be Taylor Williams. All right, so he is what position? A quarterback? quarterback it's USC. always a quarterback. He'll probably be the first three picks, but we'll All see. Right, so he, he'll go to Chicago, huh? Trades are always in the mix. Well, they traded their quarterback, so I'm assuming they're taking the quarterback. Hi, Ace. Hello. Hi, you getting love Hello. from Dad? <laughs> All it's right, beef, are you ready for dinner? Sure. It's beef sandwiches beef. on hoagie rolls with provolone cheese and salad for me. <laughs> I think I'm gonna turn into salad, but I do feel better, you guys. I do feel better since I've been eating better, so there's that. Good afternoon, evening, happy Friday. Didn't vlog much this morning because I knew our vlog was gonna be long with senior night and all the things. In fact, Jack is, he's over here, he's editing. Um, he told me I probably won't be able to watch this vlog, so I think it's gonna be a tearjerker with Mason's senior night. But you guys know the drill, it's Friday evening. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog. Don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe, 
As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.